I voted for Donald Trump in 2016, and I swear I will not make that mistake again. I, in fact, I owe everyone an apology. I, I owe the entire world an apology. Um, I've never voted for a Democrat. I wasn't planning on it this time around. I decided in probably January, February, uh, when I heard that the first case of coronavirus was in Venice, I said to everybody around me, if it's in Venice, it's in the United States. And the administration didn't take it seriously from the very beginning. They continued to come on TV and say, uh, low risk to Americans, 15 cases going down to zero, all this BS that I knew at the time was BS. Um, so I lacked any confidence and knew that it was going to be lie, deny, deflect, and now it's turned into full-blown delusions. But at that moment, I decided he, he no longer has my vote. I didn't come around to voting for Biden until George Floyd. And it was the reaction, or I guess you could say non-reaction, to Americans screaming out for justice. And then, of course, guessing peaceful protesters. I mean, uh, what country do we live in? This is insanity. And that's when I decided that Biden had my vote because we need to do whatever we can to get that monster out of the White House. And there's, there's just been so much shit since May. I mean, there's example after example after example of why he has to go. I think back to 2016 and he ran on drain the swamp. He is the swamp. He's worse than the swamp. He is the scum at the bottom of the swamp. We cannot give this man another four years, he will destroy this country. A vote for anyone other than Biden is a vote for Trump, and you need to pick country over party. Please, for the love of all Americans, do the right thing. Do not vote for that monster.